In this video, I'm going to show you how to block gambling sites and apps on any Android. So the first thing you want to do, you want to go ahead and go to your browser or Google, whatever you use, and type in NextDNS. Then the first website that pops up should be nextdns.io, and you want to click on that. And then in here, you will have to create an account and just sign in. So it's going to be very simple. Only thing it's going to require is going to be your email and then a password you can set yourself. And as you can see, it says no sign up required. However, if you want to save your settings, you will have to sign up. So I would highly recommend this. Now, once you've done this, you will be directed to my.nextdns.io, which is going to look something like this. And then over here, the first thing you want to do, you want to scroll through the top tab and you want to look for the deny list click on deny list. And in here is where you're going to put in your domains you would like to block. So for example, if you're trying to block some gambling sites, you simply want to type in their domain. So it's going to be whatever.com, .net, .whatever they use. So for example, of this video, I'm going to show you and I'm going to block, for example, Instagram. Uh, just for the instance, of course, you're not going to be blocking IG because it's not a gambling or betting site. But of course, you will have to put in your actual domain of that website you would like to block. After you do this, click on the bottom right on your keyboard on that arrow. And then once you've done this, as you can see, your gambling site will be now on the list as a blocked site. Now, here, of course, you want to make sure it's not like this because this is not blocking it. You want to make sure it's toggled to the right so it looks blue, and that means that's enabled. That's the first step. You have to just put in all your domains, just add them over here, and then you are pretty much done with the first part. The second one is you want to go ahead and scroll back at the top until you see Setup. Click on Setup. Scroll down until you will see where it says over here, Recommended Private DNS. So. In case you're using Android 9 or higher, as you can see, this is possible. You want to go ahead and copy this bit I just marked over here. So you have to mark this up, copy it to your clipboard, and then you want to go ahead, go into your phone's settings. And when you are inside settings, at the very top where you can search for the settings, click on search settings and type in DNS. Now click on search and this is going to display you a few options down here. Now the one you should click on is the private DNS or the private DNS provider host name, whichever one. And here you'll be able to see a bunch of options. Make sure it is not an off, it is not an automatic. What you want to do is have it on private DNS provider host name. So click on that and then click on custom name. And in here is where you're going to paste your DNS we just copied from the website. So put that in, click on save. And that's pretty much it and you are now done. Whenever you go ahead and try to search for some gambling sites now, for example, those sites will be blocked in case you are blocking them with your DNS. And of course, as long as you keep this address in here, you can just keep customizing and adding new websites, etc. inside uh, their website I just showed you earlier in this video. And then whenever you add this, the website will start getting blocked. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.